Francine slamming Louisiana as a Category 2 hurricane. Heavy rain and high winds pummeling the state. Trees and power lines taken down, some even ignited. These power lines cracking and crashing as cars navigate the streets. Some areas experiencing five to six inches of rain per hour. A flash flood emergency triggered in New Orleans. Cars submerged, streets turned into rivers, and drivers forced to walk the roadways instead, using flashlights, their shoes and hands. The town of Thibodeau, Louisiana, was hit particularly hard. More than two dozen people rescued from flooding so far. I think people were prepared for this storm. Um, uh, certainly the city of Thibodeau was prepared for this storm, but I have to be honest, this one packed uh, a little bit uh, heavier of a punch and more rain than what we anticipated late, late last night. This video shows what crews must navigate on the water as a shrimp boat travels on a river through little visibility. Louisiana has activated more than 2,000 National Guard troops as some areas brace for 10 feet of storm surge. Nervous, overwhelmed, scared. Even though you've been through storms mm -hmm. before. I still feel the same way every time a storm comes. In Jefferson Parish, officials warning the sewage system has been overwhelmed by flood water and could back up into homes. Francine now downgraded to a tropical depression, also affecting Mississippi and Alabama. Here in New Orleans, there was a daily record of more than seven inches of rain that fell. Francine is now the third continental U.S. hurricane to make landfall this year, with less than three months ago in this hurricane season. Ike Ajachi, ABC News, New Orleans.